Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Two weeks ago, this House passed uh, my motion, which was to put a gender lens on any budget that comes forth. And this is what that means, and this is what we expect to see this afternoon. Because uh, poverty has a woman's face in Canada and in Ontario, we want a minimum wage that's at least $15 an hour. Uh, we want affordable childcare now, and we want public affordable childcare now, not after the next election now. We want housing. We want affordable housing, and that means doing the repairs on TCHC housing, but also new bills. We need that because, again, homelessness is a woman's issue. We need a rise in social assistance rates because, again, most women, single-headed families, the face of poverty is a woman's face. They need that raise. Um, and again, Toronto is the child poverty capital of Canada, which means it's the woman's poverty capital of Canada. We need that addressed. And we need equal pay for equal work. If Iceland can do it, we can do it right here in Ontario. And I would say, Mr. Speaker, that if we do not get what we're asking for, if we do not have a gender lens on the budget, then this isn't a democratic budget. It's not a budget for everyone. It's only a budget for men. Man. That's not democratic, that's patriarchal. We need a gender lens. Thank you.